Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker Dan Harper Realtors. Well, once again, I'm at one of my favorite Texas Hill Country communities, Vintage Oaks in New Braunfels, Texas. We're in that one acre side, and I want to show off this house being built by Journey Home. Well, frankly, I haven't done a Journey Home video yet, so I want to show it off. This house is going to be is listed for just over a million dollars, just over 3,000 square feet, and scheduled to be done in uh, December of 2022. So yeah, let's go check it out. I'm starting off a little closer to the house than normal because we have been getting some rain and I'm never going to complain about that. But all this is quite muddy and nasty right now. Anyways, uh, like I said before, in the one acre section of Vintage Oaks, the interest uh, property tax rate, I'll get that straight someday, uh, is 1.87 and that's really low compared to everything else. I live in shirts and it's at 2.5. Meyer Ranch, which is a production home community just next door, um, they're at 2.74 because they got a mud tax. We're on uh, septic out here, so they don't have that. And 1.87, really gonna be difficult to beat in, uh, well, damn near anywhere in Texas. But Journey Homes uh, Builder has a good reputation or a great reputation. I've met the owner, seems like a really nice guy but this house is being built as an inventory home lots of upgrades being put into this house and just look at it. this house is going to be gorgeous i want to point out this door it's going to be a big pivot door so yeah let's go check it out i love these doors and you're about to see why I'm just kind of push on it and see it kind of pivots right there at the end so when it opens it's kind of really neat all right so i've mentioned this house is just over 3,000 square feet feet so it's a really good size home some tall ceilings some really deep tray ceilings I like that well right up front we do have the office so uh, good size office kind of normal nice view of the outside area I love this big great room concept because it just gives you so much openness. This could be your whole living space. Got the fireplace there behind those doors. They're gonna be put a mantle and some tiles. They'll be taking it all the way up to the ceiling. But check out the big giant island in this kitchen. It's gonna be just beautiful. They are putting some high-end fancy Italian uh, appliances in. I'm not even going to try to do the name because I boogered up so bad. But they're going to be putting the refrigerator, gas cooktop, um, dishwasher, all of it's going to be matching. But uh, yeah, they're definitely going to be a higher end scale. Kind of on par with the Viking and Sub-Zero. We do have a beautiful granite composite sink. Not a 50-50 sink, so I love it. Great view from behind the uh, sink area there. Go on to the pantry. Kind of your standard corner pantry. Plenty of room. This is going to be your formal dining room slash breakfast area. You can see they kind of put the tape on the floor. That's where the table is going to be. I like the light feature. Kind of very modern, nice little tray ceiling up above it. And they've kind of got a little spot. Not sure if they're gonna be doing a built-in there. They might be, but uh, lots of, this is, place is just over one acre. So you're gonna have a massive backyard back here. The sun sets on the front of the house. So this is gonna be, nice and shaded in the afternoon during the summertime i got a big beautiful covered patio and that fancy italian uh, appliances that i can't ever remember the name of they're going to be putting those out here that's included in the price where they're going to have the big uh, outdoor kitchen already pre-installed but that's coming i also found out that journey home does pay for irrigation and yard up to an extent. So they might do like 15 or 20 feet of 
sod and sprinkler in the back and then maybe 25 feet of sod and sprinkler in the front so you can do that they don't want to put it the whole yard because we have someone who puts a pool in which is a beautiful lot to put a pool in at they don't have to tear all that stuff out it does have a metal roof um i don't know if you saw that from the front but metal roofs are going to be very energy efficient virtually indestructible and a good way to keep the value of the house up compared to your standard uh shingles all right house is kind of split up in two different sides you're gonna have uh oh crap no yeah this is the i'm getting there sorry i got a little turned around this is gonna have a game room back here so this is your game room set up plenty of space to put a pool table movie room if you want to bar area there's so many things you can do uh or if you just need a place to send the kids and have kids world in here so big room just for that because you got the garage and the laundry room on the side as well powder room you can see they took the tiles all the way up to the top so it could be a really nice power room and it's going to be i love the shininess of these tiles in here for the laundry room so that can be really nice and you kind of saw on the beginning of the video this is a big big three car garage very deep has the tankless water heater so that's always nice you can see the high the access point to the attic so big garage and now we're going to come over and do the we got bedrooms off in this corner let's check those out too all right we've got three bedrooms over in this corner all good sized bedrooms look at the size of these baseboards they've got a little nuts with those baseboards but it's gonna look really nice once they put the flooring in Good size closet in this room. And a real similar room on this side. Nice view of the front. Yep, about the same closet. So you don't have to have the kids fighting over who's got the biggest closet. But look at this bathroom, this shared bathroom. That's beautiful flooring there. Gorgeous granite. That's a that's a really high level granite as well. And then they took the tile in here all the way up. Nice light fixtures. They still need to hook that up though. And this room, ooh, we got a different, a uh, little bit different than those two rooms because this room's gonna have its own bathroom. So especially if you've got uh, one older kiddo who wants their own private bath, or if you wanna turn this to a guest bedroom, you can definitely do that with that high-end granite right there. Then they don't have to come out to get ready. They can just come in here and basically just live in here if you want to. Perfect if you've got uh, a mother-in-law that's wanting to live with you or you're bringing your mom in or something or however you want to do it it's nice to have give them their own private space all right speaking of space we're gonna head over here and check out the master bedroom they've really gone kind of nuts though with this master bedroom bath in a good way once again high-end granite countertops big giant beautiful floor tiles and check out this shower <clears throat> does have the rain shower feature in it beautiful tile work nice step this is going to be a big freestanding tub eventually like i said they're still working on it still 
putting that tile in so it's not going to be pink when it's all said and done. The water closet tucked away. And then a really good size master bedroom closet until they're still working on some of the fixtures. Oh, and they carry the tile into the closet as well. Very nice. But this is still leading into the bedroom. So really good sized bedroom. Lots of light coming in from all angles. Love this, these bay windows looking over the rest of the property. It's a very flat property, so you can really get a lot of use out of the backyard. I'm excited to see what this house is going to look like uh, just a, a month or a month or so from now. Because once they get to this stage, the rest of it goes actually pretty quickly. All right, that's gonna do it for a tour of this house being built by Journey Homes and Vintage Oaks. Remember, this house is on the market. And it's available to be purchased. It's just over 3,000 square feet. There are builders asking just over a million dollars. Schedule will be completed sometime in December of 2022. If you're interested in it, feel free to reach out to me. My contact information will be on the final slide. And always remember, I am a local real estate agent that specializes in helping people relocate to the beautiful Texas Hill Country. If you want to schedule a Zoom meeting with me, click the link in the description box to schedule some time. I'm happy to help. Please do not go through this process alone. So uh, if you like this video, hit that like button. And of course, I want you to subscribe to my channel and keep sharing these videos with your friends and family. All right, take care now. Bye.